طب اني وان كان هيلب تيل مايا ريتشز ذا جوديا باوف يور ريزنج يور هاند ذا فايف ثينج ذات يو شود كونسيدر وايل ثينكينج سبيشلي ااا وير ثينجز ار لوكينج ان ذا ماب جوزي So yes, uh, things, uh, where things are. <laughs> where things are located on a map, and. Uh, the size and direction. And how far apart they are. And the different places uh, yeah. in relation. طب انف يا جودي انف هنا درغام درغام سي ذا مجان وير ثينجز ار لوكيتد ان ذا ماب ذا سايد اند دايركت هاو فار ابارت ذي ار هاو هاو ديفرنت بليسز ار ريليتد تو ايتش اذر اند كاركترستيك ذي هاف And that's it. Please underline these five uh, items. They are very important. So while we are thinking especially, we should consider the following. What, uh, where things are located on a map, the size and directions, how far and the distances between them, how different places are related to one another. So this is the relationship between one place and the other one, and the characteristics that make them places. These are the five main considers while we are talking. up the space or thinking especially thinking especially okay uh, give um, what's meant by landscape what's meant by a landscape maya yalla maya it's your turn what's meant by landscape uh, landscape or small uh, are small portions of earth yes that can be seen or viewed at one time and at One place. one place okay so that's what what's meant by landscape it also we said that earth is filled with both physical and human features who can give me examples for physical and human features kinsey kinsey climate flat yes this climate platforms and visitations in the this in the physical future features huh uh, thank you kenzie gizi what about the human features population economic activity and land use yes population economic activity and land use uh, these are when i ask you to compare between human features and physical features you give me these Uh, two uh, examples. You give me these uh, examples. There is a very important question here. Said that we don't look at geography as it is, but we should experience the geography. So, what is the use of geography in our life? What do you think is the use of geography in our life? What is it? Rashwan, if you are a if you are a scientist. Or if you work in geography, what's the use of geography in our life? Why it is important? Is it? Rashwan, do you know? I'm saying a question. Question again. What's the use of geography in our life? Why it is important? The landscape. طب ريم ريم جودا ام از يو كيف ستادي ان ذا ديفرنت سيزونز يعني ان جيوغرافي سو وي ستادي هاو بليس تشينج اوفر تايم لايك نيفر شيفت كوس مش عارفه الفولكانوز ايرابت يس وي ار ستادينج ذا ويذر سو اتس فيري امبورتنت تو ستادي ذا ويذر ان اوردر تو ديترماين اور ديلي ديسيجنز اولسو وي ستادي ايرث كويكس How uh, volcanoes erupt so it will make us uh, make our necessary precautions before these uh, natural disasters happen. 
اوكي طيب uh, also we can relate geography to history how can we relate geography to history anyone knows how they are related uh, please lower your hand if you don't know Nenu? Uh, because history uh, tells us how it shaped uh, the land. Mm -hmm. well, it tells us what يعني, uh, things were said. <laughs> tells us what things were in the يعني, place. Yeah. At the beginning, geography studies all the resources. Yes, Yagizi, you want to add more? Uh, Miss May, because uh, يعني, like they studied the earth today, they studied the earth and history and the past to know يعني, how earth was shaped and uh, people lived there, how they spoke. And the Thank you very much, Yagizi. Yes, it happens. When we are studying the earth, we study the, its history to know how does the earth is uh, shaped, how does the volcano erupts uh, or formed, how an earthquake uh, يعني, will... will will happen, how did it happen, how did it affect the land, weathering, uh, erosions, and so on. This is one part. Another part, uh, our, uh, uh, the Earth is full of uh, resources. So while we are studying the Earth's resources, we will know important reasons in history behind invasion. Why foreign countries come and invade our country? Gizzi, you want to add more? Miss, can you repeat the question? What's the relationship between geography and history? Uh, because the geography uh, يعني, explains يعني, how the earth was like in the past, in history. Yes, this was your answer. I was repeating the question if you want to write it. But these are oh. mainly the parts in page two. Page three, guys, page three. Page three, we have question five. Describe the difference between relative location and absolute location. What's the difference between relative location and absolute location? Hannah Hamdi? Yes. Yes. Difference between relative location and absolute location. The relative location is where something is how as yeah some place is compared to another, uh, and the absolute location is um, uh, where uh, where something is exactly found. Okay. Um. We also have imaginary lines that we can use them while describing places. What are these imaginary lines, Maya? Miss, can you say the question? We have imaginary lines. We use them while describing places. What are they? Two types uh, of imaginary lines. Long latitudes. latitudes? Yes, longitudes and latitudes in general. But we have the equator, which is the zero line latitude, and we have the primary region, which primary. is the zero line longitude. Long okay. Uh, who can tell me what's meant by a region. What's meant by a region? Ali Hisham. Uh, it is a group of places that uh, are um, are close to each other and they say they uh, share the same characteristics. Who can give me an example for a region? Thank you, Ali. Who can give me an example for a region? Luji? Uh, physical uh, and human. I'm not asking how to divide regions. Yes. Uh, okay, example? Yes. Uh, yeah, and, uh, countries of North Africa? Yes. Uh, they share yeah, the religion Islam. Yes, they share the same religion, which is Islam. Also, we have the Rocky Mountains area in the United States. They are sharing the same farming crops. Thank you, Luji. Um, that's yeah. what's meant by a region. And we divide regions, as Luji said. Uh, considering two types of features, physical features and human features. Uh, what's meant by environment? Environment. Fadia?
saja. By what's meant by environment? Adam Gwaid. It's the natural surrounding of a place. The natural surrounding of a place. Um, type. We affect the environment and also the environment affects us. Do you know how? Anyone knows how to? Do we affect the environment and how does it affect us? Yusuf? The environment affects us yani by uh, natural disasters. Hmm? Uh, yeah. And the climate. Yes, climate, natural disasters happens. Uh, and we affect the, the environment. How do we affect the environment? In a positive uh, way and in a negative way at the same time. Negative way by polluting it. Yes. I'm um, off negative way, uh, positive way. Uh, anyone knows how to affect the environment in a positive way? Hannah Hamzi? Uh, yes. How do we affect the environment in a positive way? Uh, they do the like new technology and stuff like that. It's not only about the technology, no. Do you know? Thank you, Hannah. Um, cars in the in the roadway will uh, will pollute the air in a positive way. Positive, no. Yes, uh, pollution is one of the negative. Uh, they will. Uh -huh. They will build the roadway. Thank you very much. Yes, while building roads, bridges, uh, buildings, where we are to, uh, planting, mining. These are positive way how we affect the environment. Gizi, do you want to add more? Ah, Mr. You could add trees to reduce uh, global warming and uh, add filters to uh, factories to reduce uh, the gas emitted. Yes, this is how to solve the problem. Yeah, we solve the problem yes. using this way. Thank you. Thank you, Gizi. What meant by resources? Resources. Rashwan? Uh, resources and material can be used uh, to produce crops mm -hmm. and products. Or plant products. Right. Uh, movement, the theme uh, of movement. Um, do only people move or other things can move too? Just can you say again? Again. Do uh, people only move in the theme of movement? Only people can move or other things can move too? Other things, other, can, other things can move. Examples for things that can move. Products, goods. Uh, ideas. Ideas, yes. We can sometimes use ideas coming from other countries. Also, products move all the time, not only people. But what are the reasons behind uh, people movement? Uh, I have who? Reem Buddha. Um, better job, war, famine, uh, religious, and... Uh, Religious reason, reasons, housing, prejudice. Fatia, why you're opening your mic? You want to add something? Yes. Yes, yeah, Fatia. Okay. So uh, not only people move, uh, move. We have ideas and products that they can move to. Uh, what are the reasons behind movement? We said war. Famine, uh, religious reasons, better job, better life, better chance, and so on. Uh, there is something in page four. Open your practice book, page four. Using visuals. What are the visuals that? Uh, I want only the table, the table on page four. Uh, four. What are the visuals that can be used? By geographers, we have three types of visuals. Nano? Um, graphs, charts, or diagrams? Yes, we have the graphs, charts, and diagrams. The graphs will help us to compare information. Information. Uh, type. Um, Hannah Durgham. Charts will help us to. 
help shorts. Yes, shorts. Short. And uh, call me rows. Graphs help us to compare information. Charts will show information in columns and rows. Diagrams. Who can tell me about diagrams? What can I say? Yes. Um, uh, they show illustrations in the pictures yes. uh, to show something in the world. Yes. So it's showing information, but in a form of uh, illustrations or pictures to show uh, something in the world. I guess that's it about lesson one. Anyone has any question about lesson one? Especially the online students. Do you have any question? Something needs to be clarified. Study from the practice book. Study definitions from the book. Uh, textbook. Study from your worksheet. Study from the PowerPoint. You have plenty of resources. Okay? Maya, do you, do you have uh, any question? No, you must thank you. Anyone has any question about lesson one? No, I must thank you. This is about lesson one. Thomas Munkumas and Miss Arvlin events in the second green. I was just saying, study from your practice book, from your PowerPoint, from your worksheet, homework worksheet, from your notes in the notebook. Take all the definitions from the textbook. Okay. 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 Miss definitions from where? Textbook. Not from the practice book? You have them here and here. But compare. Compare. Maybe you have a missing one in the practice book. Okay. So anyone has any question about the revision of lesson one? Okay, let's start by revising lesson two. Uh, it's page five. Page five, you'll find um, all the definitions. Open by page six. Page six in the practice book. Miss uh, Sally, uh, there's a person uh, we don't know, Yanni. He's not writing his name in the class. Yes. Yes. Is it writing? Okay. Is he still? Stella. Stella. <laughs> okay. Uh, the session Aslan also is about to end. The session is about to end. Okay. If uh, anyone has any question? No. Okay. Yes. Uh, you said the quiz will be on chapter one and two only? Uh, chapter uh, one is in one and two only? And chapter nine, uh, yes, oh, yes, chapter one is in one and two only. I've already revised uh, but, uh, one, lesson two on the class, and now I've revised lesson one. If, do you have any question about the two lessons? Miss? Yes, am I? How, uh, when are, uh, is the quiz going to be for the online? I've already uploaded notes about the quiz. You can go check them. So okay. I don't give you the long, wrong timings. Check okay. the SMS. I've already uploaded notes about the project and notes about the quiz. If you have okay. any questions, send me a message, okay? Uh, Miss, I have a question. Yes. Uh, the difference between thematic maps and um, thematic time. Thematic uh, maps and general thematic. purpose maps. Oh, oh yes. Uh, who can answer her question? What's the difference between thematic maps and general purpose maps? Maya? Uh, miss, thematic maps are uh, only, uh, general maps are for multi-purpose multi maps. Uh, 
Yes. Uh, they have uh, kinds, uh, political maps and physical maps. Thematic maps shows only, uh, shows more special uh, information, specialized information. Yes, like vegetation map, like weather map. This is what's meant by thematic map. It's, it shows more detailed about specific uh, topic. But general purpose map has two uh, kinds, physical map and political maps. And they can combine more than one purpose. And you will find them also usually in the PowerPoint. Very detailed, okay? Okay, thank you. I'll see you inshallah uh, in school on Sunday. Okay. Yalla, bye. Bye.